I'm on the way the time pool I wanna be keeping you warm Right temperature for shelter you from the storm Hold on, girl I got the right tactics to turn you on And girl I wanna be the papa you can be the mom Oh oh dinners can I, I get for 300 bucks like that's a lot of turkey dinners just for you josh but are you going to be eating all these turkey dinners because i can probably do about 20. about 20 of them yeah okay josh are you going to be feeding st paul downtown st paul again yeah well you know what can i help you out with that and i'll give you the turkey dinners for free is that does that work for you i don't want to expect anything i know free. you don't expect anything but none of us do and it's always good when we get a gift right every day we have an opportunity to do something good and so today you gave me that opportunity so I'm going to say, I'm going to make you 20 turkey dinners and you are going to go downtown and you're going to give them to some people down there that really need a good meal. What can I do for you? Uh, get to feed as many people as you possibly can. Aww. Okay? Alrighty, that is a lot of food. What's in this one here? Bread. Add the gravy. Oh, the gravy. Do you need silverware? Could we just put it all in one bag? All the yeah. silverware in one bag and they yeah. can grab it as awesome. Yeah. Ready? Yes, thank you so much. Okay, now, oh. Yeah, you're good. You're good. I got it all. You got so, it all? Yeah. Okay. Go here. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. This These food are looks so good. 20 hot turkey dinners, and Ooh. they're going to be just delicious, and they're going to be so grateful. No, you and I'm so grateful that you do what you do. You're amazing. You too. You're just you amazing. Too. You make my heart warm. When I come back, I'm going to try to make things right for you. Okay. Sound good? Okay, sounds good. <laughs> the least I could give you is a hug when I get back. Yes, exactly. Your right. arms are kind of full. Can I help? I can help you out to the car. What up, man? Dinner, some bread, leave. And then I got some silverware, too, for you. Appreciate it. Of course, man. Have a good one, bro. You too. How you doing, man? Good, how are you? I'm doing good. Thank you. There you go. Silverware, some bread, and then a turkey dinner for you. Thank you. Of course, bro. Thank Keep you. your head up, okay? Thanks, man. Hey, head up, okay? Thanks, man. You got it, bro, okay? Thank nice. you. Have a nice day. You too. Everybody get down. Yeah, you do. Get the down. I got to make my own, bro. I'm going to get my plate for one. Give me one Thank of them. You. Bread's good. It's good. Bread's really good. Uh, Thanks. Come on, man. I guess it's cool, something bro. in the material. Oh, so you make the store. Hey. Happy yes, birthday, man. man. Thank you, brother. I appreciate it. I need that Blessed, blessed to yeah, see you, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We see. Good to be seen, too. Yeah, bro. You go, hey, you go kick your sheet up, man. Just chill. Today's your day, man. <laughs> Thank you, man. Of course, bro. Hey, stay up, okay? Thank you, brother. Of course, man. Here you go, sir. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome, man. Keep yeah, your head up, okay? Yeah. More here. There you go. Have a good one, okay? I think yeah. he's got, I think he's got more. 
You're welcome. Can I give you a tip? How about if I take a hundred for my staff? Mm, I like that and idea. Then I can pass it on to the staff and do something for oh, for them. That's so nice. And the, the the people that help put this together, I would really like to say thank you to them. Thank awesome. You. Yeah, they will appreciate that. And I have a hug. Yes. Okay. Thank you again. You're welcome. Ready with me to go to my boyfriend's wife's wedding and i know you're probably a little confused but i'm gonna go ahead and say yes my boyfriend is dating my aunt okay so you're dating your aunt what and honestly i love them both so dearly and like just when he told me he was ready to marry her i was just i was so excited for why I am really hoping that one day me and him can also get married. <laughs> They're so cute together, but like I love him more and I feel like I think he should have married me first. It's getting worse. I can't. I can't. I love about all this is like if me and my boyfriend ever decide to split or anything like that, he will always be in my life because of my aunt and that's why I love that they're getting married because I will always have him around. Even if he hates me, I still have him. And I know y'all probably want to know, yes, he was with my aunt first, but like, that doesn't matter. And let me tell you, so my aunt and my boyfriend, they only have been dating for two weeks. He proposed last week and they're getting married today. Look at this thing that I made and tell me I am not a freaking genius, okay? I got a blanket, right? Cut a hole in it, a little slit right in the middle. And what happens is when I climb into it, you can pull the other part over your shoulders. And when you sit down, now you got a freaking night. It's on your back, on the top, and on your legs, on the bottom. I'm hands-free, baby. I can do whatever I want. I'm playing video games. Completely covered. Boom. I have some words that I want you to try to pronounce. Um, so this is the first word. Kamaradari. Do you want to try again? Kamaradari. It's close. It's camaraderie. Try to pronounce this one. Worcestershire. Okay. Uh, it's Worcestershire. It is clearly saying Worcestershire. That's why some of these words are a bit complicated. Like, Why would think. you give me complicated word, words to say? Because that's a challenge to see if you there can There is pronounce. no challenge in this. If I want to have a Worcestershire sauce, I will ask the waiter. Waiter, can you please give me Worcestershire sauce? Because then you will understand. People like you who try to be Englishmen, they will never understand. Because you will say Worcestershire oh, sauce. It's Worcestershire. All right. Um, Worcestershire. How about this one? Corroborate. That was good. That was pretty good, actually. That was close. Corroborate. Yeah. Let's try this one. Homogeneous. <laughs> but I am not homo. I am. No, no, it's not. That's not what this means. I am uh, heterosexual. No, no, that's that's it's homogeneous, first of all, and it means it's a state of, you know what, it's fine, never mind. It's not. This is the state of being homo.
Assaulted me with a chalupa! You don't have a husband! Yeah, that's why I fuck yours! I think Joe Biden's doing a wonderful job. <laughs> and he's a nice man. Because that President Trump is just mean. I just don't like the things that he says. He's just mean and arrogant, and he's a bully. If I hear that one more time, I am going to go crazy. This man is fighting. Let's list the people he's fighting. He's fighting almost the entire news media. He's fighting all the Democrats. He's fighting all the communists. He's fighting all the socialists. He's fighting all of our enemies across the ocean. And sadly, he's fighting half the Republicans. How is this man a bully? How is he a bully? You see, we hear that at work sometimes. Some of us are a little shy about stepping up, standing up, saying anything. People look at us and say, why are you a Republican? We say, well, you know, my mom voted Republican. And I like Ronald Reagan. <laughs> I think he did a great job, and I like Reagan. And so I, that's why I'm a Republican. We shy away from the truth. We don't want to look at that person and say, you know, well, wasn't it the Republican Party that was formed to stand up for the Republic? Not the democracy like you see splayed on the news every day. You see, them folks want a democracy. They want the mob to rule. They don't want this republic. And they don't re want Republicans standing up for the republic. What in the hell are you doing out here still? First off, son, you're doing it all wrong. Let me show you how it's really done. It's me, Mario! Hello! Welcome. You've got mail. Yeah, I got hella Pokemon cards, dog. I found them in some fool's backpack at school. Hey, how much would you give me for a first edition holographic Charizard? I'll give you 12 bucks. 12 bucks? Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh, for real? Hey, Haina, maybe you can come over and we can make it a blockbuster night. I'm hella down. Mom, Nayeli's being a hoe again. Get off the phone, stupid. Shut up, you're so grounded. I can't come outside, fool. I'm grounded. Call my sister a hoe again. I always find a way. Get off the internet, I gotta use the phone. Shut up, nobody wants to talk to you anyways. What are you doing in there? I'm busy talking to my homies on the internet. Those ain't your real friends. Whatever, so jealous because I'm popular in AOL chat rooms. Now take these. Thank you! You're welcome! <laughs> Are you done using the internet? I'm on LimeWire downloading some songs. Don't rush me. I'm downloading the new Eminem song. And it's going hella fast. It's only going to take 3 hours and 16 minutes. Who's that Pokemon? Man, that's Charizard. It's 
SpongeBob SquarePants. Damn, these are getting harder and harder. How much longer? It's almost done downloading. Just give me a second. How old are you? I'm 19, man. Okay, well, let me see your ID. Before 19, man. I'll see you. No. Come on now. Tell Daddy what it say. It's your birthday today. It's my birthday today. Yeah, I'm big, pretty, white, big. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>